Hey, 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 y'all. Welcome to the channel. For those of you that are new, welcome to Birth and Bosses with Felicia. I am Boss Lady Fee. I hope you guys are having a great day. I'm having a good morning, you guys. I have on my PJs, okay? But anyway, guys, I am in here decorating, not decorating, designing this morning. As you can see, we are in a new setting. We finally got this craft room together, guys. I will have a video coming up of that a little bit later today if I don't upload that video first. But I wanted to show you guys, I had actually made a clip, um, was it? No, day before yesterday, I had actually made a clip to include in a video and I honestly don't remember whether I included the clip in the video or not and being that my time is limited I did not have time to go back and scroll through that video to see if I included the clip but the clip included these ceramic planters right here that I got from Walmart okay they were in one of the Walmarts I went in it was located um right with the Easter stuff, right? And so uh, um elder lady was standing there um, getting some of the Easter stuff. And she said, I wonder, are those planners part of it? I said, well, let's scan and see. And when I scanned it, they were 50 cents. So they were originally $5. And y'all know that I got a ton of them, okay? I did not clear the shelf because some of them was up on the sky shelf. And I just want about that life that day, okay? I just want about that life. Um, normally I'll get up there and get the stuff myself. I know you're supposed to get the people to get it down and all, but being that it was already glass and it, they were heavy, like in the box, I was like, I'm gonna just get all that I can get on the lower, um, lower level. But I got these for 50 cents and y'all, these are these amazing, um, stickers that I told y'all I had found from Dollar Tree, but I haven't been able to find them in but one Dollar Tree and only one pack. Um, I had them, I think it was last year I had them or the year before because I used them on some of my gifts. And this is what it looks like, okay? And I broke my nail at church last night, y'all. I was trying to make the nails last a whole nother week. And I actually could have glued this piece back on the bottom. But I lost it, okay? I lost it. So I was like, dang, I got to go to the nail shop today. I was trying to make them last. But anyway... This is, um, you know, what the stickers look like. I told you guys previous times, I'm not a big sticker girl. I don't like a lot of um, stickers. That's just my preference. I, I may use one here or there, but I don't like to like put, you know, five or six different ones up there. Some people do. So it's just your preference and what you like to do. So I was like, let's get all of these, right? So that Walmart that I went in, they didn't have any baskets. One Walmart, I got a ton of baskets. This Walmart didn't have any baskets, but they had these ceramic planners. And I was like, okay, no worry. Let's get these planners because we're going to use these for our inexpensive gifts. And I'm going to be um, making quite a few of those. So um, these right here actually came in perfect. Now, let me take the items out and show you guys what I have. So I've already stuffed it with my newspaper in the bottom. And um, you can put gift tissue up here. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. It just depends. Um, if, you know, it just depends. <clears throat> but either way, you're not going to be able to see it because I'm going to cover it with the shred. And then the product is going to cover a majority of it. And I'm glad I just looked at that because I was like, I don't think I put took the tag off. I actually just um, set the stuff in there so that when I got ready to design, it would be already in there let me plug up this hot uh not hot glue gun but this what do you call these things heat gun not hot glue but heat gun i just love it when stickers just come off i hate to go through all these shenanigans like this i know alcohol will remove it and all of that now so this is what I have handy, so this is what we're going to be using. And you got to be careful with this thing, honey, because it'll burn stuff right on up. I don't want this glass to break in my hand. Hopefully, that's enough to get it off. I 
I need to keep this nail like this. I'm able to grip stuff. <laughs> In my craft room, y'all, I got a trash can on both sides of my table. Hopefully, that'll help me keep things a little bit neater than what I normally do. Um, okay, so this came from Pop Shelf. These were 15 cent, y'all. I only could find a few of them. But when I tell you, I scanned when I scanned it and it was 15 cents, I was like, baby. Um, this is one of the it was part of one of the Burlington sets, and um the the pack came a loose, so that's just the extra um piece that I have that I'm gonna add, and that's an actual shower gel. This is bath powder, and this is bath soap. Okay, let's see if this right here, and this came from Pop Chef as well. This was 30 cents. So 45, 50. This right here probably cost a good dollar all together as far as investment. Um, by the time I wrap it up, we'll just round it off to maybe $2 in um, spending. And I'm gonna sell these for um, probably $25. So, It's gonna be a um like a $23 profit off of these little small gifts. And that's good for small gifts, okay? Especially when I'm doing tons of them. And we're just gonna sit that in there like that. Real cute and simple. If you have some bowls, you guys know last year we did the um I did this same type of thing with bowls. You can do the same thing with um mugs of course you know you're gonna have to limit the size of the items when you're using mugs but that's one of my most popular gifts as far as selling and as far as youtube videos when i um tell y'all y'all absolutely love when i do um mug and inexpensive videos so hopefully you guys like this one and it goes over really well Make sure, guys, while you're watching that you give the video a thumbs up. Even though, um, you know, you like the video mentally, I need you to like it by clicking a thumbs up, okay? It helps with the algorithm of my videos and help it circulate into other people's nude, news feeds, okay? So please be considerate and kind if you are learning from me and learning from my channel to make sure that you give the video a thumbs up and also um that you're sharing the video okay even if you don't think a person has an interest in it just share it it'll help content creators okay i appreciate it guys so anyway here this is wrapped and done not wrapped and done but designed and ready and um, we're gonna sit it right there let's go ahead and wrap it and then i'll do the bow after i wrap it Honey, this the last of the Mohicans right here. This the last uh, gift I'm going to be able to get off of this roll. And these scissors right here, I need to put them in the trash. I'm forever having to throw scissors away. For one thing, I be using my scissors like wire cutters, which helps to dull them right on out. Very simple to wrap, very simple to make. I'm going here to make my gather at the top. I don't do this all the time. It just depends on what type of basket it is. But most of the time, 95% of the time, um, this is how I do it. And a lot of times in my... Um, my mug gifts i'll teach you guys how i teach you in years past how to use um backers like use like a piece of cardboard or either a folder to go in the back so that um you'll have um you know you'll be able to see what's inside of the mug the plastic won't be sitting right on top of it but being that there are two tall items in here I really don't have to do it for this gift, okay? But if you're doing items and let's say all of the items were short like this, when you get ready to wrap it and you put the bow on it, you won't be able to see what's in here. But if you have taller items, that works. But if you don't have taller items, you're going to need to put a backer up there so that you can connect it up higher and those items will be able to be seen, okay? 
I hope that makes sense to you guys. So we're just going to come back here. I knew I was going to forget to get something. I'm not going to stop this video, though. Let me go get my tape, y'all. Dang. That's the thing about coming to a new space, forgetting some of the things you need. Okay, y'all, we back like we never left. I'm going to work really hard to keep this room clean because I'm able to design quicker. Not only am I able to design quicker, I'm able to um, do my videos more um, professionally. And I'm also able to do the, um, you know, I'm able to spit them out better because I'm not having to move personal belongings out of the way and mail off the table and stuff like that. I can just come right in here into my craft room and none of my personal um, stuff has to be moved. All right, so we're just going through making it tight. So even though it's not shrink wrap, it has the, um, it has the look of it. Not really, but really. Okay, it's tight. All right. Let me make sure y'all can see more of the designing and not my head rag. Y'all know I normally don't get up here with um, bonnets and stuff on. You know, if you do, that's fine. That's your business. I ain't got nothing to do with it. But I normally don't. But, you know, I feel like I got it wrapped in kind of a little cute little way where it doesn't look, you know. So... Hopefully that's okay. It's okay with me anyway. I do believe in being presentable. I got my bed clothes on, but I have my bra and everything on, so. All right, so that's that, and let's do this. Now, this is gonna show you guys how to, let's see how many minutes, oh, oh, oh. Let's end it here. We'll come back and do a two part. I wanna show you guys how to enhance your baskets and possibly can make it sell for a few more dollars. So I said 25, but from what we're gonna do, I'm gonna show you how you can add at least five more dollars, um, at least, or I'll say at least three dollars, maximum five more extra dollars, okay? So y'all stay tuned for that video, but let me know what you guys think about this so far. Hopefully YouTube will catch that. All right, make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell so that each and every time I upload a video, bam, you will be the first to be notified. Get your money, honey, and fill your bag to the next video. Bye, y'all.